When operating in AED mode, the heart start intrepid can perform semi automatic external defibrillation on both adults and infant child patients. You can also monitor the patient's cardiac rhythm, SpO2, ETCO2, and airway respiration rate in AED mode. To defibrillate in AED mode, you turn the therapy knob to AED and the Heart Start Intrepid announces and displays the current patient category. Adult mode. The Heart Start Intrepid then checks to see if the therapy cable and multifunction electrode pads are properly connected. If not, it advises you to plug in connector, insert connector firmly, apply pads. Connect the pads to the pads patient cable. Apply the multifunction electrode pads as directed on the package. The patient contact indicator is located at the top of the display screen. If the patient contact indicator is orange or red, adjust the multifunction pad to maximize contact. Stay clear of patient. Analyzing. Stay clear. The heart start intrepid analyzes the heart rhythm and announces if a shock is advised. Shock advised. The Heart Start Intrepid automatically charges to 150 joules if the adult patient category is selected, or 50 joules if the infant child category is selected. Once charging is complete, the Heart Start Intrepid prompts you with Shock advised. Deliver shock now. Make sure no one is touching the patient or anything connected to the patient. Call out clearly and loudly, stay clear. Then press the flashing orange shock button to deliver a shock. Upon delivery of the shock, shock delivered. The shock counter registers the number of shocks delivered. After a shock is delivered, the device pauses and you are prompted, begin CPR. The heart start intrepid enters a configured CPR timer period and reanalyzes the ECG when the pause period ends, or you press Resume Analyzing. Stay clear of patient. Analyzing. Stay clear. If a shockable rhythm is not detected, the device tells you, No shock advised. Analysis is suspended during the configurable pause period, at which time you administer CPR.